Today we have for sale something very exciting and special to show you and this is our 2021 on a 21 plate Ford Transit Custom. This is the MSRT automatic double cab. So the auto double cab comes with the two litre Eco Blue diesel engine with 185 brake horsepower and as I say this one has got the automatic gearbox. Uh, it's a five seat double cab in the short wheelbase version and spec with a tailgate. And what we're going to do in this video is have a little walk around. I'll show you the spec that you get on uh, an MSRT and there is a lot to talk about on this particular van but I'll try and keep it as uh, brief as I can because this is one of those that could go on for 20 minutes if uh, if I let it um, and we'll also talk you through the condition of this particular example seeing as it is actually currently physically here available for sale at the time of recording but for how long who knows so starting here then at the rear of the vehicle as I mentioned then this one is spec with a rear tailgate so very nice to have a tailgate one door which opens up like so unglazed so you haven't got a window in the back but the benefit of that is it keeps that load space completely private and out of the line of sight. The colour on this particular van is called Squirrel Grey, it's a special vehicle uh, order paint. Um, I think there's three of those particular colours, there's a, there's a yellow, a blue and this uh, lovely grey colour which I think for me is probably the best colour to have the MSRT and I think it looks really really smart. Of course, the MSRT is far from standard, so these vehicles do start their life as a 185 brake horsepower limited van. So it's got basically all the spec that you get of a limited, plus effectively every optional extra which you could tick from the factory. And then it's given to MSRT and they do their magic with it as well. So looking here then at the rear, you can see that we've got, uh, as I say, full body styling on this particular vehicle. So this beautiful MSRT rear spoiler but what I really love with uh, this vehicle is just the attention to detail so little MSRT badge there nicely in the spoiler we've also then got this fantastic uh, rear diffuser here with the twin exhausts and uh, I'm delighted to say these aren't sort of fake exhausts like you get on a lot of vans uh, this is a proper exhaust system on here but again just really gives the back end of this van a really nice look to it. Rear parking sensors of course as standard you'd get that on a limited anyway um, and as I say this one is spec with effectively have every optional extra so you've got uh, a reversing camera there as well. In terms of condition here at the rear uh, I mean absolutely spot on just having a look in the reflections here where available you can just see how clean and tidy this is. If we open up the tailgate then we can start to have a look at the load space in the back. The lovely thing with the tailgate, as I say, as this opens here, you can see this gives you a really nice shelter. So if you were going to be out in the rain, uh, it does give you that nice shelter there from the weather. Looking in the back, you can see that the sides of the vehicle are ply lined. That is, is, of course, there to protect the vehicle. So if you've got cargo in the back of here, it's going to be moving around. It's going to protect the van from any outside dents. We know the owner, uh, the previous owner of this vehicle, it is one owner from new. Uh, and we know that they have used it as a car and you can clearly see that from the condition here in the back obviously never done any heavy work at all plenty of tie down points in the back and as i mentioned you have got that bulkhead there as well which gives you that separation between the load space and the cab um, one to keep any you know smells or uh, and as a security as well uh, for any items which are going to be in the back of here looking at the inside of the tailgate again all ply lined in the back of here and you can just see how clean and tidy this is no issues there at all and of course optional extra led load lights in the back as well for when it gets dark much better visibility in there we'll start to then go down the outside of the vehicle here so starting here down the driver's side uh, so as i say it really is a full uh, styling body pack on these particular vehicles so everything uh, is changed almost so these rear bumper corners here again not standard you can see that they are uh, they're flared here uh, this uh, black element here is uh, that's not a, a, a vent that is there purely for aesthetics but as I say that is uh, different as well to go along with the arch extenders which are of course on there as well but just gives it a much more aggressive look one of the only uh, actual sort of defects on the vehicle. There is a very minor little touch-in just here. So I'd like to point that out. 
uh, but otherwise there's really not much to uh, to fault it on but looking down then as I say down the driver side of the vehicle you can just see how clean and straight that is no dents or pin you know not even a pin dent down there it's looking very very smart indeed the MSRT is specced with genuine OZ racing uh, 18 inch alloy wheels uh, and they are shod in Firestone tyres. Uh, we've actually ordered two new Firestones for the front of the vehicle, so you have a full set of Firestones uh, on the vehicle, all in fantastic order. Uh, and you can see here in this lovely gunmetal grey colour in really, really good condition. And then looking more at the body styling here, so we've got this lovely MSRT side skirt, and again, really nice detail here with the MSRT embossed there and a lovely gloss black insert there in the side skirt as well. Again, another MSRT badge here on the trim down the side of the vehicle. These come, of course, color coded as a, uh, as a limited as well. Being a double cab, you do get twin side loading doors. So we can open the rear of the vehicle from both sides. And this is where we get our first look then at the interior. And one of the features I really like about uh, these vans are the seats. So you get a half Napa leather, half Alcantara um, seat with this very, very smart blue contrast incision. I think the blue actually complements the squirrel gray very well indeed. Of course, you've got uh, Isofix compatibility in the rear and then these lovely touches here, MSRT celebrating the world rally championship uh, previous wins for Ford. Looking then inside here, again you can just see how clean this is, the uh, condition of the step, the carpet underneath, the over mats, which again lovely little detail there, the MSRT badge there on the over mats. And looking at the back of the seats of course again covered in the Napa leather with the lovely blue stitching down the back there. Got a very special thing to show you just there, we'll come to that a little bit later on in the vehicle, quite unique to these vans. And then let's open up the driver's door and start to have a look inside here. And a nice, again, a lo lovely feature. These are a limited uh, edition vehicle. So you can see there this number M1295 and that nice plate there on the side of the driver's seat. And having a look at that driver's seat, of course, all the usual adjustability, so height adjustability there. This is adjustability of the front of the seat. You've got backrest adjustability as well. And again, lovely leather, Alcantara, very, very comfortable indeed. Again, that nice embossment there in the, in the backrest and even an Alcantara headrest there for you. Lovely leather armrest. And as I say, this one is specced with just another single seat in the front. So you've got all the same adjustability on the passenger seat there as well. And again, a limited comes as such a well-spec van anyway. So you get electric windows, electric folding mirrors, as you can see there. You've also got uh, auto activated uh, lights and auto activated wipers. Uh, you can see that this one, we have got two full remote keys for the vehicle and even the original MSRT uh, key ring there. And a really defining feature of this vehicle is the steering wheel. So a very, very thick steering wheel, but very nicely molded there, as you can see for where you'd put your thumb and these fantastic carbon fiber inlays in the steering wheel and on top up here as well. But just feels uh, very, very good quality. And you can tell when you start driving this vehicle, when, you, when you're using the steering wheel, of course, you can just tell that you're not in a normal transit custom. You're in something a little bit more special. Looking then at the onboard uh, computer here. In a second, this will uh, show us the mileage here, but you've got the screen uh, in the middle just there showing your range uh, and everything else. And then you can see the mileage there in the top left, 14,223 miles. And again, another nice MSRT badge in there. Up on top of the dashboard, a USB and, an eight and a, a 12 volt socket, sorry, uh, and a bit of extra storage. You can see I've got my phone plugged in there. Reason for that is you have got Apple CarPlay on the lovely Sync 3 screen here in the middle. So you can, of course, use your Apple Maps. You can listen to your music there uh, via Apple Music or Spotify if you wish. You can also listen to your podcasts. Uh, very, very intuitive system to use indeed. If we put the vehicle into reverse, you can see that's where the uh, reversing camera is then uh, displayed. If we go back to the uh, normal Sync screen here, if I just shut the door to stop it 
dinging at me here a second. Um, if I unplug my phone, you can see here that this actually changes from Apple CarPlay to navigation. So you have got uh, actual inbuilt sat nav on this vehicle as well if you don't have your phone plugged in. If we go to audio as well, you have actually got DAB uh, radio on here as well. So if you go into sources, you can see we've got DAB radio just there. So really nice selection of spec on the sync screen. In the middle then, all the usual stuff. So air conditioning, heated windscreen, heated um, seats, heated door mirrors. So fantastic selection there. As I mentioned, this one is the automatic version. So I would assume uh, much preferred to the manual. And then as I say, looking here, on the right hand side here you can go through the different modes you can turn your park pilot off or off or on and uh, you've got your uh, traction control button just there as well just down to the left hand side another usb port and a 12 volt socket as well and nice storage up here on top of the dashboard but as i say the thing that really strikes me in here is just how clean and smart this is as i say of course it is a 21 plate vehicle with only 14,000 miles so you would expect it to be in very good order but it really is very very smart indeed and as i mentioned has been used just as a car if we jump back outside as a nice msrt mats in the front here as well jump back outside continue to go around the rest of the vehicle uh, there is actually i say with one other defect on this there's a very small mark on this alloy just here at the very bottom but as a very minor and is on the very very lip lovely arch extender here on the front and again one of the other defining features of this is this very aggressive front end and this is a great angle here where you can really see the contour of that front bumper it just really sets the vehicle apart it's often been i guess tried to be duplicated but has never been successfully done i don't think i think that just looks absolutely fantastic there's a whole so it's a whole new front bumper from uh, MSRT. You can see this lovely lower splitter here at the bottom, nice big grill there at the bottom as well with again another little MSRT badge in there. You've got front parking sensors of course as standard being a limited and then another optional extra this one has actually got the by Zen on HID uh, headlights so you've got the lovely LED halo daytime running light there around the outside, front fog lights there as well and in terms of condition here at the front Oh, very, very good. A couple of very, very minor stone chips if we're being very picky, but uh, not much to talk about there in terms of defects looking very, very smart. But what a good looking van that is. And there is, I guess, the question, is this as good as it gets? Does it get any better than an MSRT 185 Auto Double Cab? Um, it's certainly out for debate. If you have an opinion on that, I'd love to hear it in the comments section if you're watching this on YouTube. For me, it's got to be a contender, surely. Especially in squirrel grey as well. Looking here then on the passenger side, just lovely condition throughout. And then finally, one I mentioned I wanted to show you is with your MSRT, you do get this nice briefcase, uh, which is uh, branded just there. And if you open that up, it does come with this sort of collector's pack here. So. Uh, whether you'd actually use this or not, but certainly a fantastic thing to keep for the future value of the vehicle. So you've got the MSRT baseball cap, there's a tyre pressure gauge in here, there's a, an MSRT wristband, a little cloth, a, a maintenance vehicle guide, and then underneath that we've got things like an MSRT air freshener, there's a lanyard in here, a torch, a pen, and even a touch-up pencil as well if you were to get any little stone chips on the vehicle. But a very nice uh, piece of say, whether you'd actually use it or not, uh, that is another question, but a fantastic thing to keep as a future value and collectability of the vehicle down the line being such a uh, limited edition vehicle. And where do you see these? As I say, if you were to go and order one of these today, I think you'd be looking a long time and it would probably be considerably more than what we have this vehicle advertised. So just to summarize, 2021, on a 21 plate Ford Transit Custom. It's the 320 model, so 3.2 ton gross vehicle weight. It's got the two litre Eco Blue, 185 brake horsepower diesel engine, which is of course Euro 6. You can take this into the ULEZ zones without having to pay the ULEZ charge. It's got the automatic gearbox and it's a short wheelbase, five seat double cab van. Finished in the fantastic squirrel gray, 
absolutely beautiful condition and of course spec very excited to be able to show you this here today if you'd like to see the full advert including all of the pictures and of course the uh, the price and photography etc please head over to our website there progenvans.co.uk and i say that's where you'll see the full advert we will of course welcome inquiries on either of the numbers listed here at the bottom of the sign we can arrange finance on all of our vehicles starting as low as 7.9 percent apr and we can also arrange finance for uh, limited um, companies as well not just private individuals and we can take uh, cars or vans in part exchange we very much look forward to hearing from you thank you very much for watching